Hello Leo, welcome to your bonus love reading. Let's see what messages will show up for you today. Leo, this is a collective love message for your sign. Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. So please take what resonates and how it resonates for your overall situation. Let's see. Mm, twin flame connection it's showing up here. 5D. Yeah. Two more for mutual energy, please. Courage and challenges. Mm -hmm. I feel that this connection is this connection here, Leo. It's not particularly easy. We have future at the bottom of the deck. Very nice. There is a but but spirit is saying here that you know uh, you can overcome those obstacles challenges that might have occurred in this connection because this is a mutual energy it might take courage uh, to to kind of uh, take certain action to take certain action in order to resolve something here with the five D this is a five D connection it might be this kind of very strong telepathic connection that you share with this person for instance you might think about them and suddenly they are calling you or they you hear their name or there is a song on the radio that reminds you of them yeah very very strong connection on their side we have spiritual connection on your side we have twin flame i feel that you see them as a tw as your twin flame leo and this person here it's 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 feeling this connection but it's different this is, a, this is a connection that they've never experienced before in their life. That it's something else. Very strong, magnetic bond I feel you share with this person. Future. So it feels like, you know, overall energy, it's, spirit is kind of pointing out that this connection has a potential uh, to be a success in the future. Let's see. Let's see. Leo, um, this person's energy. We have the King of Pentacles here. Seven of Swords. Let's see. Show me this person's energy towards the end this connection, please. Too many. Thank you. Page of Cups. A star you might be dealing with Aquarius three of Pentacles page of wands knight of wands and the card number 13 the death card at the bottom of the deck, we have a Five of Swords. This is someone who doesn't want to play mind games anymore. Mm -hmm. Something here significantly is changing when it comes to this person. It's like the shift, it's happening. I feel that this, this connection again, it's something different. And it kind of made them, uh, make this person to, to kind of notice certain things about them. Also, I'm getting that it kind of uh, stimulates some sort of kind of transformation that this person might be undergoing at the moment. And it's like a detachment from this mindset, this kind of self-sabotage mindset, because Five of Swords represents that sort of kind of uh, energy. It is also energy of mind games. It's like this person doesn't have to pretend anymore. They can be themselves. We have a page of cups with the star. This is beautiful energy. This person here sees a potential for emotional fulfillment when it comes to this connection and you, Leo. They are full of hope. It's like a wishing upon star for things that, that you know, can, can, can occur in this connection. This person is full of hope. They also see a direction when it comes to this connection with the three of pentacles. 
It might be someone from your workplace or somehow connected to your work-related matters, doesn't have to be. But with the Three of Pentacles, this is someone who wants to be a team player, who wants to prove that you can't, that, that they are reliable, that they are loyal here, uh, that they are open for collaboration and compromise. Page, sorry, page of wands to the Knight of Pentacles. This is very interesting because it shows next to the death card, it shows that this transformation has been taking a long time in the, for this person. You know, it's like this person maybe you're dealing here with a metaphorically saying in the brackets with a creature with the, a creature of habit. And it's very difficult for them to change certain things about themselves, but it feels like they are changing. They are really changing and it might take and I feel it, it's this person's, um, it's been a long windy road, let's say it that way, for them to kind of acknowledge certain things and to change, uh, to change something about them, about their mindset or the way they kind of see in connection. With the page of wands, communication here is coming and I feel that this person wants to talk about it, this changes that they might be um, trying to... Um, trying to um, oh I've forgotten uh, sorry I lost the word <laughs> implicate to their life I don't know if that's correct I hope you know what I mean that they want to kind of uh, that they want to do those adjustments let's say it that way okay I do apologize <laughs> um, for my broken grammar but they want to talk about it they want to talk about that i feel that this person wants to share that things are changing for them that they are changing mindset that they are realizing certain things here and and at the end of the day that you are very very important for them but they but they are focusing on this change and it, it it's like this person wants to come across that they means business that they are with with, the, with this change they also uh they changing um they are more serious i'm getting about something here but uh the main thing the main thing when it comes to this change or this shift that might be happening transformation when it comes to this person's energy leo is that they no longer want to lie that they no longer want to play mind games and they want to detach from that sort of mindset so please take it how it resonates you might be dealing with scorpio let's see let's see the let's see your energy we have an ace of swords It's like they want to make an adjustment here when it comes to their everyday life mindset. I feel that's what I wanted to say. Hi, Precious. So you might be dealing with Pisces, Four of Souls. I feel very strongly here, Leo, that you tried many, many times to get to the bottom of something when it comes to this person or connection but every time when you tried to um, talk about this 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 issue or certain situation here this person was causing an uh, enormous amount of uh, of confusion and it's like you couldn't get to the bottom of something You don't trust them. You don't trust them, but you see them as a, I feel, as a twin flame. We have double confirmation, four of wands, ace of wands, the sun, and the four of cups. Interesting dynamics. You might be dealing with, with another Leo, <laughs> Leo, with the sun energy. You might be. Doesn't have to be the case. That's also your energy. 
yeah with this with this with this ace of war with this ace of <laughs> with this ace of swords to the to the high priestess it's like i feel that there was you tried to gain some sort of information about something but with the four of swords and the seven of cups it's like this person was trying to they came across i feel you didn't kill someone who can be quite manipulative with this five of swords at the bottom of the deck because it feels like they tried they on purpose uh was giving you some sort of information but at the same time they were creating some sort of confusion and they and I feel that at the end you felt oh my gosh I need to take a break because that it's so confusing four of swords with the seven of cups it's like this is so confusing that I need to take a step back and rethink this again because this is not what I was expecting at the very beginning you might thought that you are gaining some sort of clarity but when you took a step back and you sat down and you you'd start thinking about the situation you suddenly came into realization that it's not the case that this person actually wasn't fully transparent and I feel that it caused you enormous amount of sadness with the five of cups please take it how it resonates I feel it is a particular situation here that we are talking about you see them as as your twin flame or at the end of the day you would love to be in a stable relationship with this individual but I'm getting that for now something here doesn't make you happy with the with the four of cups it's like you are thinking about the situation yes you feel this connection you you are aware of happiness that this person might be bringing to your life but there is something that is still playing on your mind with this four of cups we have to say of once and the sun which is a beautiful energy yeah and that's what i was getting it's it's something here will happen it's coming also from your side i feel that you really want to get to the bottom of something and i don't feel that you are ready to give give up on this and with the ace of wands you're manifesting is you're manifesting this this enlightenment this clarity because sun put put lights on something and with this high precious you might feel that something here this person is hiding but it will come to light and I feel that this person needs to do that pretty pretty quick because um, as much as I feel that you recognize this energy this connection that it's profound that it might be twin flame I feel that you know within time if this person will maintain that sort of dynamic of uncertainty when it comes to this connection you might just get bored and at some point you might reject this because we have seven of swords as an overall energy you don't trust this person it might be a case that you caught them when they were telling you something else and they were acting differently behind your back or there was a situation that at some point you were talking about a specific matter and after two days you kind of this matter resurfaces itself again you've asked them again and they provide you with a completely different explanation and then you say aha so you are sneaky you are hiding something here and i feel that's the whole thing this this they are showing me here a specific situation please take it how it resonates for you but confusion 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 and i feel that you don't trust this person you have your reasons of course with the seven of swords it's like you sees them as they yeah i have feelings i recognize how profound this connection is and i feel that deeply inside you dream to have this stability and future with them but they need to prov they need to um it's like the, there is something here that they need to clarify it they can't just avoiding this they need to talk about it and I feel that there will be a conversation with the Ace of Wands. This is what you're manifesting behind the scenes. Leo, you are very powerful, obviously, with this energy. And we have the Sun, so this is an ultimate card of happiness. So this happiness here is on the horizon. But this person needs to, needs to do that, needs to come forward and needs to have this conversation with you. Because at the moment, I see you being not happy. I mean not happy in the sense not being fully satisfied 
with with what with this connection or what with regards to this particular situation it's like a disappointment and dissatisfaction but the change is coming very positive change very positive change show me the outcome we have the hierophant you might be dealing with taurus show me the outcome with regards to this connection for leo and this person please we have strength we have the three of wands and we have the six of swords at the bottom of the deck so it feels like this connection it can be um uh, it feels like the harmony and this connection can be uh, taken into the karma waters can i say that can be moved into karma waters that's what i want to say so uh, with this with the six of swords it's like um, something is gaining more balance and harmony tranquility you know and if things has been chaotic and quite challenging when it comes to this connection some sort of positive resolution it's coming here we have the hierophant strength so this is your energy as well leo so you might be dealing with another leo and we have a three of wands this is a commitment with the hierophant with the strength yeah with the three of wands if that's what you want leo this is what what it's coming to you with the three of wands because it's like you're manifesting this dream come true this is expansion this is growth this is waiting for this metaphorically saying ship meaning goal coming your way and it's coming with the strength it's like you are you actually actually in control when it comes to the outcome and I feel that this person, because we have this hierophant here on their side, it's like I feel that this person will tell you that they do want a higher level of commitment with you with the hierophant. That they seize this connection uh, differently and they take things seriously when it comes to this, this, this relationship. So you have ultimately someone who wants to bring some sort of change, to, who wants to move this connection into the calmer waters, bringing more harmony and balance. And I see actually in the outcome a uh, stable relationship. And I feel with the three of ones, this is something that you've been waiting for, for some time. This person will provide some sort of clarity because something is changing and they are realizing that they need to stop acting in a certain way because that might create at the end of the day of self-sabotage and this is the last thing that they want with regards to this connection because they feel this connection and they want ultimately future with you on this side we have a hierophant this is someone who wants to be in a higher level of commitment with you and it's coming and it's coming so you here in the middle of this reading as a bonding energy it feels like you know it depends on you if you want this therefore i feel that you are actually uh, very strongly manifesting again a major change major positive change when it comes to the when it comes to this connection leo leo i will leave it here thank you so so very much for being being with me please like share and subscribe and once again thank you very much for your time I truly appreciate you. Leo, have a fantastic and absolutely gorgeous day. And once again, thank you very much for being with me. Take care. Bye.